Welcome to our section uh, technical learning by professormessage.com even though we named it technical but you can also call it theoretical and technical learning by professormessage.com now this training is specifically geared toward uh, towards A plus certification uh, 22901 and 22902 and the reason we added playlists from professormessage.com YouTube because he keeps it up to date so we don't need to worry about updating his content as you can see um, it's pretty much a lot of videos 77 so this is where I tell my user that start the A plus certification but this should be on the side you know you're taking one or two videos a day but then you want to move on quickly to the real world courses now the reason we share this with you is that for example if you have to drive a car for the first time you need to know about the car itself you need to know a little bit background of what type of engine it is or what kind of things are inside maybe there's something important that you need to know so this is the kind of information that you need to know about like RAM, ROM, BIOS, CPU sockets and stuff like that that you probably will never touch or maybe you will touch it but not like a daily thing it could be a year that you need to open a computer and do something like a change of memory or something like that so this is not a daily type of thing and this is not a real world type of uh, you know uh, training but it gives you that core it gives you that learning that you need to know uh, what it is in IT terms if somebody talks to you about uh, you know some specific thing then you should know how to do it like for example network connectors and stuff like that we don't teach that in this course we basically teach you real world scenarios related to these things we don't teach you what is connector and what is made of and all that that uh, technical learning and and uh, theoretical learning behind it like how did how does the connection work and stuff like that we don't teach you that this is why you you go with the certifications and you learn about these things or maybe you go to college and you learn about that in the book where you have a lot of theory theory and then you uh, kind of know that so this is where we don't do that it is already done we don't want to reinvent the wheel again it is done in a very professional way and people love it you guys can see it yourself now moving on uh, what I did is this is all videos so let's say you're taking the A plus certification and this is where, uh, where again the practice lab is going to help you and that's why I recommended it because you're gonna come across it many times so now you're if you're taking Professor Messer uh, 901 uh, uh, and then come to 902 which is more applications and you put your hands on and do things now in the in the first one it's more hardware and you can see uh, not much you can do uh, and these things are available to you physically so you can see right here 902 is more of applications and things like that so this is where hands-on lab access like library access will give you full access uh, and you can actually practice this on and I'll show you that in a second right now and you can see you can take the IT fundamental course which is a single lab and also you can go for 220 902 with Professor Messer 902 and you can actually practice what Professor Messer is teaching so that is pretty cool you can actually do that so you can see right here if I go to the lab I'll show you that in a second if you have CompTIA or full library access so you can go for CompTIA bundle if you are just training for CompTIA then maybe that will help you I just logged into my lab right now and let's say uh, this is a Cisco environment I'm gonna go down this is library access full access so you can see CompTIA right here 22902 if I click on it then you get this PDF on the left side so for example they have all these exam related uh, titles right there uh, if I click on that and let me just show you one thing that why uh, you need the learning like Professor Messer with this even uh, therefore it is therefore advice to refer to your own course materials to gain a deeper understanding of any theoretical aspects of exam objectives and this is where why we shared Professor Messer full training with you because it's very detailed and uh, a lot of people have success passing the certification again I don't want you guys to spend too much time and because like I said this is going to take you away from the real world scenarios unless you have too much time to do this first and then come back to the real world that is fine if you're looking for the quick skills and you want to while you're learning about certifications you can still finish our courses 
gain all the skills, start applying because what when when you go for jobs, you actually may not have a success in first or two or three interviews, but you will learn from it a lot. You know, this is where people will learn so much when they see and hear things in uh, in a real world and how people ask questions, and this is where people land job without even having certifications. Now, all you have to do is to tell people that I am taking certifications. These are examples. Show our courses. Show the labs. Things like that. People will like that idea, and we have success stories. You can watch that later on. I'll show you that also. So this is it, guys. This is where I wanted to explain a little bit on this. Uh, why you need to know. Uh, why you need to start at least with A plus certification if you have no certification. Now, of course, if you're taking college uh, training and they have their labs and everything, you can go for that. Uh, if you are taking only courses somewhere, then you can do the mixture of labs with your training. If you don't have any training, you can go for the Professor Messer one, which is free right here, a lot of content, uh, and then you can take a lab with it. So this is how you can start at least the more uh, theoretical and technical training on a specific uh, that uh, specifically done for a plus certification and after this we are going to talk about our first real world course which is going to be very important for anyone starting IT career I'll see you in that section